Instrument Landing System or ILS. In this video we will learn about navigational aid, called as Instrument Landing System. Instrument Landing System is a ground-based instrument approach system, which provides precision guidance to an aircraft approaching and landing on the runway. These are used for providing safe landings during instrument meteorological conditions or IMC, such as low ceilings or reduced visibility due to rain, fog, or blowing snow. The ground equipment comprises of two highly directional transmitting systems, called as the localizer and glide slope, and three marker beacons. Localizer is an antenna array, normally located beyond the departure end of the runway. These generally consist of several pairs of directional antennas, which transmits two signals. Each antenna transmits a narrow beam, one slightly to the left of the runway centerline, the other slightly to the right. It gives azimuth information, and indicates whether the aircraft is on left or right of runway centerline. A glide slope station is an antenna array sighted on one side of the runway touchdown zone, approximately 150 meters away. It provides vertical guidance or elevation, and indicates whether the aircraft is above or below the glide path for the approach. This ensures that the aircraft is following the glide path, and remain above obstructions, and reach the runway at the proper touchdown point. The pilot controls the aircraft, so that the glide slope indicator and localizer needle remain centered on the display, to ensure the proper landing. In addition to the localizer and glide slope, the ILS is typically equipped with marker beacons to assist pilots in identifying their location on approach, known as the outer marker or OM, middle marker or MM, and an inner marker or IM. The outer marker is typically located from 5 to 7 miles from the end of the runway threshold. The middle marker indicates a position approximately 3,500 feet from the runway threshold. An inner marker depicts a position approximately at a distance of 1,000 feet or 300 meters from the threshold. When the aircraft passes outer beacon overhead, a vertically emitted radio signal activates a rapidly flashing blue light on the aircraft's marker beacon receiver. It also produces an audio signal, which is two Morse code dashes per second at a low tone. Middle marker is typically the location, where an aircraft on approach will be at an altitude of approximately 200 feet above the elevation of the landing area. This system enables pilot to visually identify the runway either by pavement, or with the assistance of an associated approach lighting system. This marker's audio signal is a series of alternating Morse code dots, and dashes at a high tone. When plane passes overhead and an inner marker or IM, aircraft's marker beacon receiver flashes a white light in unison with the received audio code. The marker's audio signal is a repeated Morse style dot at 3 kHz. I hope you well understood about instrument landing system.